He's been gaming for over 30 years, representing the common man in gaming, bringing you the new, the old, and everything in between. Here is your host, LMG. Greetings and hello, my fellow Alarm Darkins. Welcome to Alarm Dark Gameplay number 59. Yeah, I'm just doing some prep work around here, getting ready for our episode here. And actually, they would have a comment and tip from another viewer. A little bit in one of the earlier episodes, I just tried to apply now. I was working on a... I actually decided to... Uh, we're going to wear the basic boots inside because right now it's... The coldest... It might not hold up if there's a blizzard outside. It seems to drop the base temp in the camping office here a little below that. But yeah, that is actually uh, negating most of that. So we're going to wear the basic boots inside and store uh, the insulated boots. We're only going to use those when we're outside. But actually, we're going to get out today... Get that today, and we're gonna get. Ba -ba -ba -ba. I'm actually gonna store that for our next. We're gonna get our clothes on, so we don't freeze. We gotta put that on. Yeah, we're gonna. Uh, we're gonna work on the getting the. We're gonna check out the hat, the hat new hatchet uh, degradation, and we're also gonna try to repair that uh, one of those rifles. So let's get our clothes on. Yeah, but we're just reminder, I'm going to be using those boots. All just in, well, we're, the basic boots just were inside. We'll cut down on our wear and tear there. Okay, so did I grab, make sure I grab the hatchet. So just one second, guys, make sure I got all that. Not carrying the rifle, we shouldn't have any problems. I do have to, try to repair that hatchet. I think I've got another one around here somewhere, but I've got so much crap, it is kind of hard to remember sometimes. It's like a hoarder's dream. Yeah, I do have plenty of uh, scrap metal, though, so I don't have a problem with that. Yeah, plenty of scrap metal. Plenty of scrap metal. So let's go outside. We don't actually have the rifles, so we gotta be a little wary in case we do run into a wolf out here, but we should be alright. Hey, we got a, a crazy deer going out here. Oh, he's all, all about. Huh, okay. Alright, we'll get a couple things to talk during during the gameplay, but I'm gonna get out here and get we're gonna get straight to business first. Hopefully try to get a lot of recording today. I am moving in about a week or so here, so I gotta finish packing up. I gotta stop I'm kinda of screwing around. Let's get up in here. I have a tip on Twitch, this is probably a good spot to try this, so we're gonna see. I'm only gonna go for about two hours because the cold is. It is pretty uh, nippy out today. I don't wanna put it on too much degradation. Yeah, so they they pretty much cut that in half. Okay, let's. Oh, let's we'll just go one hour. It doesn't seem to be any. Uh, that's like the exact same as it was before. Oh, I don't know if that's gonna apply. It applies to the save game or not. I'm gonna have to figure that out. Let's we'll just see if we can get any uh. For firewood here. Cedar, well, damn. And actually, they have been people have been having some luck with getting a uh, fir firewood from hand forging. So maybe we'll have to try that. Cause that condition of the hatchet's getting a little bit low for my liking. Now let's get back inside. I might just actually go back to my lucky areas for me. That's what makes me feel better if something does go wrong. Alright. Drop off this wood. Try to get this in a neat orderly pile here. Yeah, definitely with the increased uh, calorie usage on and all the way you're carrying, we really gotta watch what we're doing when we're inside here. Let's actually put that leather back in here. Make 
that's almost a good kilogram right there. I'm just going to keep our hatch in here right now because that's just a better idea. We're going to try go out and try by hand. Just a little bit after we warm up here. Just warm up, then we'll get back out there. So I'm going to do a try it side by side doing a hand one. Then we'll see. Fair while we're at it, why don't we uh, do this real quick? I want to see how that works anyway, so let's get it. Oh, so just about 20% per, 20 in there. Let's try another one. Just haven't really messed with the lantern fuel uh, little things here before, so let's mess with that. Yeah, but man, when you put those clothes on, that's at least close to 100 Extra calories an hour you're burning. Yeah, well, that's only about 10. Okay. Let's warm up and get back out there and then we'll get. Uh, see if we can find some fertile firewood. If not, that's what I probably want to do right now is try the forging by hand instead. So that uh, hatchet goes out. That will not be good. Plenty of food. We've got a uh, Carl 2 out there just chock full of stuff. And also Carl 3 out by the derailment. And Carl 3, and this Carl, original car here, he's still our favorite Carl. We're just gonna, we stuffed him with some just miscellaneous stuff. Because the inside corpse, not frozen. Gonna degrade normally, probably even a little more than the other containers, but those are pretty much full anyway. I do not put food in Carl. It is, a, it is a bad idea. So now I'm waiting during this video that they're going to come out of a fix for frozen corpse uh, containers. We will see. Okay, are we quite warm enough yet? Just want to wait a little bit more. What is that? About one calorie less, it seems. I'm fatigued are we? We're a little fatigued. I'm gonna go rest for an hour and then we'll that will take care of that. I try some forging by hand. I usually never had any good luck with that, but some people say they're having some decent luck with it, so we'll see. We'll just rest for like an hour. Hydrate up. One thing, quick thing I will mention about the leaderboards is I'm not really going to be talking about the leaderboards anymore right now for a while because uh, with the, the exploits and everything, the scores have gotten kind of jacked up. Because uh, I believe Raptor, I think he's number one right now on the leaderboard. He's got over uh, a year, I think. Over a year of survival time. Yeah, so... They wiped out a lot of good player scores, but they kept, yeah, almost close to 10,000 hours. Uh, I'm not saying that's not legitimate, but come on, really? The math alone kind of warrants, but, I mean, it could be. I'm not going to judge, but, yeah, we're not going to pay attention to the leaderboards anymore. Nope, nope, nope. Because that guy, I said to some people, uh, leaderboards in a game always become suspect down the line. So, we're not going to pay attention to that anymore. And that's all we will say about that. All right, let's get out and we're going to try my other spot. Where? I need something to eat. Yeah, I don't know, Wolf's side. Uh, yeah, there's been a return from the... That Wolf that's always hanging out by the camp office. I have not seen him again, but... We did run into the one wolf out there. Right, but once we get back inside, we're going to try this real quick. Check the time here. That's only about close to two. we still got plenty of time. Weather's well, been pretty cooperative also. So. 
Got my usual lucky spot I try. I always want to make sure you're doing this away from any wolves because the wolves uh, can interrupt your foraging and attack you. So you want to do this. Make sure you're safe. Yeah. Look, we're okay. Actually, what I did try, I did go over here. We'll try that spot again. I did have fairly good luck. And as soon as we get back from this attempt, we're going to go just get everything we can not carry possibly off. Slow down that condition. I do need me some fur firewood. It's not a uh, dire, but it's We'll come down the line. Uh, right, just for luck's sake, I will go back to the usual spot I go to. This little down tree here. Around here, I think this is just... It feels right to me. Guys, it just feels right. So let's go about here. We're just going to do this for about two hours. Now with all our clothes, it's only about negative two, so that's not horrible. Okay. I really just don't want to try any more than that because, uh, yeah, just the condition will go down. It's going to get cold fast. Let's see what we get. Ah, reek. All right, now where on earth did I get reclaimed wood? Hmm? Ah, all right, whatever. It's okay. Another tip if you're new to the game, any kind of bad weather happens, just remember you can always follow your footprints back to where you were. In our case, well, this is actually just a heavy wind. That's not too bad. Yeah, but I would advise against going out for long periods of time doing that to forge because yeah I can easily uh, if you're not paying attention you can uh, freeze it up pretty easily especially if your air gear isn't up to snuff and let's get in and get these clothes off get warm switch to our uh, those regular boots see if that equals out the temp Well, will, because I can definitely save on the wear and tear of my insulated boots. That would be nice. We do have some raw meat I want to get cooked. That's over in uh, the way to take and dump real fast in Carlos, too. I'm not quite sure if it'll make it back or not. I almost want to take some stuff to start a fire with. So we could cook it there and then store it back in Carlos, too. That might be a good idea. We might do that. We've not had an outdoor fire in quite a while. I think we did when we were up at the logging camp area. All right, let's get in here. Okay. I remember to take those out later because I was just ch checking the condition. Yeah, I believe the matches I had earlier are still like 50 something percent out there. At least. And they haven't really degraded at all, but in here, yeah, they are degrading. So, you want to store your matches inside. We'll actually get to that in a second, but I'm going to dump this wood. We'll get the clothes off. How do you get reclaim wood all the way out there? That's just that's a bad loot rule if I've ever heard one. Get that out. Get these clothes off. And test our out the boot theory. So we maintain that it only takes leather to maintain it. Leather is actually pretty much renewable out here for the most part. Because you get that off of wolf and deer. That could come in quite handy. Let's get the clothes off though, put that in our drawer. Let's 
sure if I can fit all this in here. I can't fit it all in. All right. And you should be basic boots at 98%. Okay, let's put that on real quick. Gotta keep a close eye on that. As we are experimenting, we always want to make sure. How many calories am I running at? 198. Anything I can do to slow that down? Let's go by weight. Oh, I guess we don't need the lantern right now. We could store that. And the ammo. We could, yeah, we could store the ammo, too. I'm afraid the ammo degrading, though. It would be degrading just the same if it was on me, so... Uh, that's a valid point. As I'm talking to myself, but it's been a month, people. A month out in the cold, so we're, we've gone a little mad. It's actually full. Full. There we go. Oh, I don't think I have any. I might be over here where in the cabinets we can just throw the bolts. I like that, I'd almost rather store it out. I don't think I have any room in Carl 2 though. Let's close. Oh, we got plenty of room here, so yeah, let's just do that. This will definitely save us when we are... Uh, trying to put all our bolts in there. Well, we actually got bullets also in the rifles themselves. We're sitting pretty good on bullets right now. Okay, okay, okay. I don't really think I can get too much more or less. Uh, oh, I could really. I mean, there just weighs it weighs so much less. It's really. But uh, could we get some more? Water situation is somewhat decent right now. I really detect. Well, I will get one of those uh, all day uh, water bottle that water bottle uh, cooking's going sometime soon here. Well, I might as well get some. Uh, time is about five. So we're actually gonna get. Actually, gonna f I've been going up to four uh, four hours now, because you get a, ba a base average of uh, five reclaimed wood per four hours, which isn't too bad. Burns for about two and a half hours altogether. We're only gonna get two because it's getting late, and I stored my storm lantern down there. And if I get lost at night in the dark in the cabin, that will be embarrassing. It has happened before. Carl actually did have to rescue me, but for two hours we got three, so. It's not bad. Let's drop that. So I'll go back to alphabetic. I'll like that better. Make sure we hydrate. Almost feel the condition. Yeah, it's going to slow it about as good as we can. Okay. Okay. All right, might as well just slip off here. About five ten. I'm just making a mental note of the math to see if we compare if we do add it with clothes later on. I'm trying to rest. I'm going to get this down as good as we can for the viewers at home here. Five days. So it's about a one percent per hour, baseline average. It's gonna rest on till morning, so that should be sixty-eight percent. I want to say. Yeah, that's a good time in the morning.
Hydrate again. Nice. So we'll probably go chat. Let's go try our hand at uh, forging outside again. Just gonna grab the clothes though. That's all we're gonna grab. Uh, there we go. Okay, get that. So those insulated boots are kind of a pain to repair. So we don't only want to use that when we have to. It's a cloth and leather. Leather's not a problem, but the cloth is kind of kind of want to preserve that as long as we can. So if I just wear the basic boots inside, that will save me a lot of wear and tear on those. Put that back in there. Okay. So let's get out to getting on. Got it. Eat. Eat. Not too bad out, really. Check the temp. Oh, that is cold, though. That is cold. The sun has quite come up yet. But... And I might just actually... I want to go try up here. That was really no luck for us, but we'll try up here, maybe. See how that goes. Yes, we could find a good lucky spot that isn't too far away. Okay, so we're gonna try for two hours. Hopefully we can get some fur firewood. Well just <laughs> balls is what I'm gonna say. No. Oh. Freezing. Let's get back outside. Ah, oh, great. I don't feel so good. It's so cold. Oof. Up a bit. Oh no. No. Oh, I know. I know. Get my my basic boots back. I think it's going to be able to land random loot rock luck, I think, to uh, get that fur firewood we need now. Uh, but time is one thing, something we do have, dear viewers. That is something we don't think we do have. Well, that and dementia after all this, I tell you. Alright, let's get back that back on. Okay. Check. 286, am I still... Maybe it's not just for this hour. I'll have to check on that. Because I shouldn't be... the whole hundred extra. Hmm. Uh, Alright. You know what we could get? What time of day is it? Ooh, it's about 10. Yeah, we could get some water going. Yeah. Why not? Could be fun. Alright. So, so hungry. So hungry. Yeah, let's get some water done. Let's try to be a little bit productive here. Okay, so let's add that to the fire. Should be able to get us five liters out of that.
Okay, I got five liters out of that. I think I'm going to drop some. That's probably factoring into our fatigue and our calories. Eh, probably not so much now, but... Yeah, that must have just been for the hour to that 286. You're not going to die. Don't worry about it. Don't know how many times we've done this, Jennifer Hale. You think you'd start to trust me. Five liters is the max amount of snow you can get and also boil at the same time. There we go. Just being a little uh, less greedy on the water right now since I do have do have an abundance going. I just might let that fire go out. Yeah, that's not too bad. That's not too bad. Let's make it feel nice and cozy when I see that. But actually, yeah, we still got... Let's try to get at least another liter out of that. Uh, yeah, a liter would be a safe bet. Probably takes maybe an hour total to do that. So let's actually do another one and see if that pans out. Oh, sorry viewers, not much I love math in this game for some reason. I like my math. Yeah, a little bit around. Okay. Just gonna drop some of that though. Just a liter and a half. There we go. Okay. So the base temp is... Well, I can't tell now with the fire going, actually, but... Base temp still seems to be okay. Uh, kind of fatigued, though. Um... I will heal up tomorrow again. What I think we'll do is we'll go out to the derailment. I'm gonna take some. Uh, I'm gonna take some wood. We're gonna start a fire out there. And I'm gonna eat, cook up uh, that meat right there. I'm probably gonna eat it and then come back. Sounds like a good idea. We could, we could start a fire up in, uh, I don't know if you can do it in the, we'll find out if we can do that up in the, the rail car there. I'm not sure if the game will lay, I never tried that before, but it would be a nice and out of the way though, out of the weather. So let's actually get... Try to travel light as possible, we said that we're going to have to close, but other than that... Okay, 31%. And I usually don't, I never advise that going out and exploring when the condition, but with the wolves the way they are now, it's uh, as long as you're smart, it's not too bad. Is that a, I hope that's just a high wind. I'm probably gonna need. I'm 
just gonna be paranoid about this. Interesting. That should be enough, I think. Let's get dressed. Not taking the rifle, I don't want to add the weight, and I, I don't plan on shooting anything until we get that repaired. So let's get our clothes on. Okay, make sure I get the boots off. Nice. All right. Okay, so let's get going. Sounds a little windy, but we'll be all right. We're gonna start a fire anyway, it's so the trip will be okay. Let's go out for a quick jaunt. I hope this doesn't end badly. Oh, well, we're midway through the show here. I'm gonna give you about a little bit more of the, the teaser for. Uh, that big long and dark event. I'm actually gonna have to. I, I do have to move this week, but I'm gonna do a lot of recording on the long dark, which I will drop throughout the week. But yeah, our basic. Uh, I need to get this run done before the big long dark event. That's the thing. So I, if it comes to a point, I might have to just end up killing myself. I don't know. <laughs> no, we'll we'll go out classy. Go out fine to the end this time. I think. What is the temp it feels? Negative 36. Awesome! Yeah, it felt colder than it normally did, so. I thought I saw something out of the corner of my eye. I know it was deer earlier, but I thought I saw something else. And hopefully there's no wolves up at the drill. I mean, if there is, we'll just head back and we'll eat something out of car number two. I know, Jeffrey, you're cold. We're gonna get we're gonna get warm here in just a second. I'm gonna confirm if you can start a fire up in the the train car or not. I, would, I think you'd be able to do since it's not technically inside, but sometimes the game is a bit wonky on that. So hopefully that meat held up. Carl number three, I'm coming. I'm coming, Carl number three, and we gotta be careful. In case, that wolf we got it. He probably had yeah, the animal, uh, the predation and everything. Apparently, they just hold the carcass off. A little weird, but hey. Yeah, the only thing we didn't get out of it was the leather, but I wasn't too concerned about that at the time. I think that might be a wolf. I'm not entirely sure. Kind of far off to tell. Okay. We're holding up rather well, so let's. I'm gonna go. I should cook. Depending on how much time we have. I don't. I could. I could cook the rest of that. That will last actually a heck of a lot longer in the cooked form for in the frozen container, but we're gonna try to get... Oh, come on, I know I'm freezing, but... Work! Oh my god. I seem to be stuck on something. Oh, ho, ho. Come on, with... There we go. Let's see if we can start a fire in here. Ooh. Fire right in here would be pretty nice. We'll see if we can get one going. Oh, you can. Nice. Seventy-one uh, percent. Okay, we'll take that. A two and a half hour fire. So we'll see if we can get that going. Okay, we gotta cook that. That. Uh, degree it fast we don't watch what we're doing we gotta hurry because oh we're warming up actually so that's conditions to slow down now I 
As long as we got in the fire. Uh, should I screw around like this? Probably not. Close real quick. I'm just gonna get them out of the use. Go, 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 go. Now, wolf meat is actually more calories than. Huh. Than the venison. That's interesting. Maybe they may more, more worth, worth the uh, wolf kill. And hopefully the fire hasn't. I'm bad. Dang it. Oh, seriously? Like, really, I'm having bad luck here. There we go. I'm gonna try to keep that down. Don't burn yourself. Jeez, don't do not do that. Okay. Well, we got enough time. We should have enough time. And next time we'll bring, we'll bring out another fire here, and we'll get the rest of that cooked. We're gonna take this back and eat it and heal up. Feel a little safer with the rifle, but uh, should be okay as long as we're smart. Let's get back going. I think there's a, that is a wolf, but he's keeping his distance, if anything. But wolves are still pretty buggy. And they're not in the numbers I'd like to see them, but I just seem to be we seem to be losing our sense of uh, danger in this game, kind of really. As long as you play it smart. Yeah, but it was just. I feel like I'm losing the danger sense a little bit here. Still a great game, but I just wish more things would try to kill me, sadly. Let's get back in. By the time we get back, it should be around 20% uh, or so. That will heal up quite nicely. Let's see how that uh, wolf me pants out. I don't know if that was raw or the cooked. Cooks probably calories would be less. We'll check when we get in there. Now I can't quite remember. Yeah, guys, remember when there used to be wolves all along here? Now we got nothing. Nothing. Because that also could be the result of the save game. I'm not entirely 100% sure, but... Yeah, let me know, guys, how your wolf population in your games is uh, going. Mine's been pretty stagnant. I miss the old days when you wouldn't go outside because there'd be a wolf lurking right outside the camping office there. I kind of do. Let's get back. That'd be close to 20%. Yeah. Beautiful day though. I can see a deer up on the ice over there. Just one lone deer, nothing else. Okay. Get back inside. It's so cold. So cold today. <gasps> Alright. This, this is serious. Oh, All it's right. not that serious. Come on, Miss Hale, we've done this a dozen times already. Get rested here. We could actually wait down until it gets down to 20, but let's just not be crazy. Well, I think it's uh, 1500 calories uh, raw, but then when you cook it, it's about 1250. It's about the same on par with venison. Okay, that's the way it is right now. It's cooked. Yummy. Well, 
Well, yeah, we're over 2,000 calories now. Woo! That wolf was yummy. That is an abundance of calories, actually. Carefully heal up. on the basic boots just in case something a little cold does seem hmm oh must not have paid attention to the thirst oh really did that happen I'll still be okay must have not have been paying attention to the thirst as much that's a little weird Oh, I think the cold might have actually been a factor. Yeah, the, those boots aren't working out as well as I thought, I think. Just for maybe the, all the cold outside is affecting the cabin temperature. So, crapple on that. And we stored the lantern to shite. Let's see if that's actually enough to... care of this. Um, I think if I could find the... No, it's covered. <laughs> it's funny in this land you can get yourself in, in such things. Oh wait, well, go back. Oh, I don't have the... I really should destroy the lantern up here in that. Okay, well. Oh, do I burn a match for this? Dang it, I should burn a match for this. Damn it. Oh, a cardinal sin. Sorry. This does not go out before I get that lantern, though. Go, 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 go. What's in the other door? Oh, I don't think I put in this ones. Oh, no. Oh, this is getting embarrassing. I can't see. Oh, God, I've gone blind. Wait, wait, go back, go back. Okay, at least we got... Now that's one drawer two down. Too much. So that must be the top drawer. Second drawer. Third drawer. Ah, I figured it out. Let's actually get, the, yeah, get those off. Must have dropped just a degree to one percent of condition. Maybe that was. Yeah, because you gotta watch your. your this has gotta be perfect for this trick to work now, really. Otherwise, we kind of just wasted our food there. It kind of ticks me off a little bit. But, uh, what are you gonna do? We'll ride that out back to 20% again, though, and we'll do that properly. Yeah. Did not apparently. Alright, new rule. We keep the lantern by <laughs> the cabinet in case something like this ever happens again. New rule. Alright, oh, sacrilege me burning a, ma a match like that. Oh, God, where's the lantern? Gonna be in this one. I know, put it over here. There we go. 
Oh. That's so funny. Well, how'd you die? I was trapped in the dark. We still have, don't worry too much, folks. We still have plenty of light, uh, matches. I just, sometimes bad crap happens to me and I do apologize. But, make sure I'm just wearing the boots. Okay. Yeah, I believe that cold is affecting our other conditions also, so. Ugh, that was an experiment that went well for a while, but. Yeah, I think unless you get that 98% all the time. I'm going to say probably, it's better to just go with our uh, insulated boots in the long run. So we don't have snafus like this. I'll grab water just in case. And make sure to turn that, no, turn that off. Make sure to hydrate. And we'll throw that lantern in the cupboard in the morning because I know I can at least find that. I don't know if anybody else hears that in the game, but I swear I hear a new noise now here in the cabin. I don't. It's gotta be my imagination. But I swear it's coming from the game now. Oh, we've lost our mind. Okay. Oh, that ticks me off about that boot experiment. That did not work as well as the beginning. Okay, we got a blizzard, so I don't believe we're getting anything done today. This actually might be a good uh, spot to cut it off then. And then we'll get started. Uh, with our plans for the next uh, video. So we're sitting here in a blizzard. Uh, We'll cover any of the new uh, Alarm Dark stuff that come out since the since the last video, but I am going to record these in a in a long stretch here. So, but we're sitting at 37 days, almost 38. We'll get into the 40th day next episode for sure. Okay. Next couple episodes, we'll get to the 50 and beyond. We're sitting pretty well. I am doing a lot of experimentation in this run, though. Alright guys, hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to like and subscribe. As always, my usual plug. But most of all, I want you guys to enjoy. Learn a lot about the long dark. And I will see you guys in the next video.